the 27th of the 1st, 2014. This is your radioactive reality. Hi, Jen. Your mom said you were watching. Any news? Uh, after seeing that map with massive amount of nuclear waste headed to the west coast, there's going to be impacts. Radioactive water still hasn't stopped flowing from Fukushima into the Pacific. We've been telling you over and over again, you know, over 300 million metric tons every day going out of Fukushima and directly into the Pacific Ocean. Reports, white goo everywhere in Alaska seal. Crows won't touch it, yet they eat people's roofs. Slime in one's mouth, kidney almost black. Another appeared to change color. Hairless one seen recently. We're, we all have six seals here, and uh, they're saying it's connected to the Fukushima radiation. Uh, apparently all that radiation got trapped up in the snow, and then when that snow melted, went downstream, it affects all the way down the line, and this stuff accumulates. Um, this has more to do than just bananas. Highly radioactive groundwater now flowing under unit number one. Level skyrocket since last test. Always skyrocketing, isn't it? Now thousands of times higher. Eight locations hit records in recent days at Fukushima Daiichi. 1,053. Every day. Just gets worse and worse, don't it? Historical weirdness. Historical weirdness. Expert says U.S. government has failed public by not testing the Pacific for radiation. A very obvi obvious need since Fukushima is leaking into the ocean. They told me, it's salty and that's not our thing. This is how all our different alphabet soup agencies are ignoring this issue or flat out lying and helping perceive the lie. Uh, as reported in released NRC documents, this is insane. Underground holes may be needed to search for Fukushima 3 molten cores. We don't know where it is. Cold shutdown. It's cold shutdown. Did fuel escape via basement? Question mark. Yes, it did. Experts unsure if TEPCO will allow them to search for corium. Why would the Yakuza let anybody in there? Their cleanup site. Scientists present links between unusual Alaska seal deaths and Fukushima fallout. Skin lesions, hair loss, lethargy, pulsed release would build up red, radnaculoids were sent uh, free as ice melted, as I said before. You know, this isn't bananas, folks. This is not bananas. At the height of Fukushima Emergency Region in California, where, where Plume hit, had no monitors. They shut them all off. Email shows EPA decided not to deploy Radnot to area. Got to save that economy. Only one left broke as radioactivity began to spike. How convenient. No clue about exposure levels. You got no clue. Just how bad. It hit you, me, and everybody else in the Northern Hemisphere. Every 40 days, there's a spike. Can't be changed and can't be stopped. Radioactive Fukushima water will continually enter the ocean. Significant discrete leaks recently. West Coast should be alarmed at lack of testing. Levels rising for two years and expected to increase indefinitely. Remember, this thing has not stopped leaking. This wasn't a one-time event. The big spike right now is because the industrialized coastline that was Japan and swept out to see that great tsunami with the 9.0 earthquake in 2011 swept it all out in the Pacific Ocean and most of that toxic soup mess is slapping up against the West Coast right now along with the radioactivity. 
This accumulates. It accumulates. You know, if it's just a couple of bananas, you stack a couple of bananas on your head every day for 1,053 days. See how not dangerous bananas become over time. Bananas. Senior scientist at MIT events, Japanese scientist censored, not allowed to publish recent research that compared Fukushima to Chernobyl. Fukushima, arguably bigger. <laughs> no argument, it's bigger. Newspaper ignores scientific models that show Fukushima radiation impacting West Coast. Navy officers on TV, my body is falling apart. After Japan rescue mission, his right side just didn't work. Another can no longer use his legs, unable to urinate if 300 times normal radiation is okay. I don't know what to tell you. It's okay. It's just a few bananas, folks. Just a few bananas. Nuclear engineer footage shows me it's broken. There's really no containment. Duh. At Fukushima reactor number three, I expect many different kinds of leaks will be found. Especially the big one underneath when they dig a hole under. Where'd the corium go? We don't know. Shock and outrage. Japan TV host revealed being told he cannot discuss nuclear power until pivotal Tokyo election ends. It's a big taboo subject in, during the elections. Uh, somebody needs to bring these issues to the media. The media is a controlled propaganda machine set up to deceive you. Here's what we want you to think today. AFP fears that molten fuel went into the ground after melting through containment vessels at Fukushima. We've been reporting this over and over and over and over again. Why do you think everything keeps spiking? Reports of it leaching directly into the Pacific Ocean, underneath the harbor, and beyond. Alaska Marine expert, we really need to look at what this is happening to the ecosystem from the Fukushima radiation. Models don't address ongoing releases at the plants. A lot of unknowns for a lot of uncertainties. Ships are sampling for everything but radiarachnoids could be affecting the animals. They're going to blame everything, anything and everything but nuclear energy on all this mess. It's your fault. It's not their fault. It's going to be your fault. Watch. It's just a few bananas, folks. Don't worry. Alaska refuses to test radiation levels in fish. They refuse. It says banana is riskier. Ask them seals how risky those bananas are. And who doesn't love bananas? It's bananas, all right, and the insanity continues. U.S. military baby wipes tapes were main weapons for battling Fukushima contaminations. Soldiers didn't wear protective gear because we didn't want to alarm the public. How much tourism dollars are they going to lose when mainstream picks up and they can't hide it anymore? that the entire Pacific Ocean has been contaminated, polluted, and is leaching into our rainwater. It's so contaminated. And these bananas will stack and stack and stack because they don't go away. Significant amount of radioactive seawater to hit Southern California, question mark. Expected on beaches in the near future. Fukushima contamination may be persuasive across the food chain. And that's where the real danger lies. We're ingesting this. It's in the crops. It's in the food. It's in the water we drink. It's in the air we breathe. Every day. Every day. These bananas stack on top of us. Every day. Wall Street Journal, Japan, U.S. physicians claim radiation risk due to Fukushima nuclear accident. Uncertainty over quality of radiation data coming from officials. Big surprise there. Kyoto News, Fukushima raises concerns over viability of Japan's future. 
Former Prime Minister Reactor Restarts a Criminal Act Towards Future Generations. Shut them all down. Every single one. Highest yet radiation levels hits new record in Fukushima groundwater while strontium through the roof, beta emitters. You notice they only tell you about one or two things when there's actually 1,300 radioactive isotopes. They can all be found together and must be tested separately. How convenient is that? Nuclear expert Fukushima very critical for entire humankind. Japan won't let any foreign experts visit. They are behaving rather strangely. Nuclear scientists, radioactive emissions still taking place all the time. All the time. Pouring contamination into ocean may cause elimination of fish resources. Do you know seaweed, seaweed's used as an emulsifier in a lot of commercial products? You'd be surprised with seaweeds in. Where do they get that seaweed? How safe is what you're ingesting? Simply Info. Nuclear power utilities bought political fundraising tickets with power customer cash. They spent just enough on tickets to be under the disclosure laws in Japan. We know what's really going on. Former Diachi manager will become new leader at Diachi, or former Diani. Intends to fix the leaks, uh, bolt together tanks, putting metal caps over the failed interior seams. <laughs> They're going to put metal caps over the failed seams in those tanks and call them good. The ones that are rusting in place, full of radioactive water, emitting x rays, gamma rays. They're so radioactive. Uh, children's teeth in Japan will be tested for strontium-90. Untested soybeans from a required testing area and I wait previous over limit readings were distributed for sale. Officials have been trying to recall the soybeans but have issues tracking them all down. These shady guys can switch stickers and warehouse at their leisure. Uh, yeah, more untested cattle in the system. Um, yeah, all kinds of crazy stories on that site. TEPCO, over to Fukushima Diary. TEPCO is filling up part of Fukushima plant port. TEPCO announced they are filling a part of the Fukushima plant port by concrete and rubble. They are surrounding the seaside from Reactor 1 to Reactor 4 and outside the port by steel pipes and concrete. These are supposed to be greater underground wall than the one in land. Remember, it's all seeping up from under the floor now. They're trying to cap that. But by doing this, they're going to back up the river that's running down and underneath this thing. Since they built it on top of a riverbed, it's going to back up and cause even more problems. Uh, the main concern is source of the seawater intakes of reactor 1 through 4. They will be sealed by this. Uh, however, it, uh, it can cause the overflow of contaminated groundwater in the plant area. Obviously, they're building a great big dam on a river. What's it going to do? EXSKF. According to TEPCO, Fukushima 1 uh, reactor 4 spent fuel pool assembly removal at 14% done. According to TEPCO, and we know how trustworthy they are, uh, spent fuel assemblies, 198 assemblies out of 1,331, 22 new fuels, the unradiated one, and 198 of the spent fuel pools, according to TEPCO, have been removed. Another story on ESSKF, the Obama administration demands Japan to return 300 kilograms of weapon-grade plutonium to the United States sent during the Cold War era. Going to confirm the already released um, Freedom of Information Act um, document stating that the CIA was funding a secret nuclear weapons program in Japan for like 60 years. Just insane amounts. 
So now China's all fluffing up and they're saying, ah, we're going to let China know that Japan's got nukes, but without really letting them know that they got nukes. So uh, can we have that pl weapons grade plutonium back, please? Mm. Finally tonight, over to World Nuclear News. This is a very proactive, yay, nuclear industry uh, website. Consistency required for Fukushima return. Documentation near Fukushima Daiichi plant processing more efficiently with convergence of measurements that will support a return to evacuated areas. An IAEA team encouraged experts to communicate that radiation dose rates below 20 millisieverts per year are acceptable. See, the problem is, is they're just going to measure everything from like a meter off the ground. Um, there's all kinds of give and take about this, how they're justifying that. Now, um, it, it's actually their, their report's high because, you know, who spends eight hours a day outside getting radnoids that were measured a meter off the ground, blah, blah, blah. But uh, they're getting ready to send people back or probably cut their funding is basically what this story is about. That's about all I have for you today, of course. If I missed anything, please let me know. Attach your comments or uh, send me a message. Joy Way Can, everybody. I am. Thanks.